Excuse me. Hold up, please. Excuse me. Excuse me. One second. Thank y'all so much for coming. How y'all doing tonight? So, tonight is very special because everybody know I'm about to graduate and finally get these masters. Education, number one. So I'm writing my thesis paper and I've been writing it for a while and I'm doing the human anatomy about men and women in Atlanta and why we can't get it right. And I, I was reading, it was like, it's the top six people that you meet. You meet the player and the cheater. We have boring fucking sex. Oh, don't put my leg up. Don't pull my hair. Cut the lights out. I feel fat. All that bullshit. <laughs> you meet the broken woman who sits around and take all the abuse from an insecure man. You meet the gold digger. I call her Misfits Plaza. Can I get some cash? For this ass? Can I get a little money? For this honey? And then you also meet the good guy who should be sitting right in front of you. I'm giving you gas money. I'm feeding you. I'm clothing you. Fuck these flowers. And the last two is a real man and a real woman. This is why we're having this conversation. I welcome you to my home because I want everybody to understand, we're moving the rocks tonight. Mm -hmm. Tonight is called the True Circle Dinner. Okay. I like that. We're gonna drink, we're gonna eat, and we're gonna talk. Tay Tay, my first question is to you. How hard is it dating in Atlanta? I'm so damn tired of these dudes in Atlanta, Georgia. All they do is lie, they not honest, they wanna just keep playing with your damn feelings. And then when you like the honest girl or the one who really wanna get married and have kids, they so quick to leave. I'm so tired of men in Atlanta. They flex, they flodge, they're fake. I have a technical question for you. Did I oh, meet? a technical? Yes, did I meet this man oh. living with his mother or what? Is it something that, you know, happened after what we were together. Hell, that I makes all the difference in the world. You tell me. <laughs> you create the scenario. And we have been taught that a man is supposed to be a man regardless of what we do. So which means we could be have nothing. And y'all are still supposed to be the ones that uplift us. What y'all moved to Atlanta for? It's 15 to 1. Plenty of women out here. This our city. I love multiple women. Got plenty of money to blow. That's all y'all want anyway. Um, love don't pay the bills. So if my man's gonna cheat, either I'm joining in on the coaching. Hey baby, turn around. You can count on. You can count on me. Hey baby, turn around. You can count on.